Now to defer a message, what we have to do here, instead of abandoning, first I will defer it here. And in this again we have to pass the message which we want to defer. Once we have deferred, we can go and read the defer message. I will tell you how we can do that also. To read the defer message, what we have to do? We have to create a service bus message received. And here we have to use receiver dot receive deferred message asynchronously and in this we have to pass message dot sequence number which we will be getting by this way and here if you see instead of now defer message no instead of here reading the message body I will go and read the def message okay let me just run this and I'll put a debugger here we will go step by step Now click F10, it has created the receiver, it has deferred the message which means it is available maybe whenever you want to process it but since we want to process it immediately, press F10 immediately and then you can see again we can have the hello Rohit using the for the of the deferred message. Cool. So this is how we can read any message which we have deferred using the deferred message APIs. Cool.